Have it. You have the amulet of kings. Here, the amulet belongs to you. Belongs to me? The amulet of kings? So you and Joffrey have said. If it is true, if the emperor really was my father, then I should be able to wear it. Only those of the Septon blood can wear the amulet yeah, of Yeah, I know. Kings. Just put it on. Put on the amulet, your majesty. Yes, of course. What am I waiting for? After all, this is my destiny. And no man can deny his destiny. You see, you are Uriel's son. I didn't really need the amulet to tell me that. Oh, now you're telling I've me. I've known it was true since you first told me back in Kavach. But it is one thing to talk of becoming emperor. And quite another to actually be the emperor. You are the emperor. Not yet. Until we light the dragon fires, the gates are open, and Mayroon's Dagon's invasion continues. While you were gone, I sent a messenger to Chancellor Ricardo. He waits for us in the Imperial City. Why meet Ricardo? Chancellor Ricardo is the head of the Elder Council. The Council rules in the Emperor's absence. I don't expect any objections from the Elder Council, but we should defer to their authority. Let's go to the Imperial City at once, before the enemy can recover from Manka Cameron's death. They cannot. But where the hell did you come from, dude? What's up? Like, seriously. He is the epitome of evil. Look at his eyes. He's... He's... He's plotting world domination. He's... You're the reason because... For all the, uh... For all the Oblivion stuff happening around here. Well, if you follow me, that's okay. I don't care. You're gonna die anyway. But, there are only a few missions left. I believe there's... Good evening, sir. One last bunch of missions that you all do at the same time. So, why don't we throw a save here and go do those now. And travel to the Imperial City Palace. To the Temple of the One. The Aeliads, or Heart Heartland High Elves, ruled Cyrodiil in the Long Ages of Myth, before the beginning of the recorded history of recorded history. But the uh oh, come on, dude, go away. The city will be under attack very, very soon. Do I need to talk to you? I'll see you again, sir. Martin was worried. But that I is knew very nice armor. Back the amulet of kings for him. Nothing. Okay. Keep your heart true. Uh, is he over here already? Because I thought that he would be teleporting to where I was, not to the temple of one. Oh, there you are. Let's go. Hello, Okado. Everything is ready for Martin's arrival. Don't worry. Yes. Where is Martin? Well, he's right over here. Can you not see him? Oh, there we go. <laughs> Had to circle around them for a bit. We have arrived in the Elder Council chamber. I must formally present Martin's claim to the to Chancellor Okado, the head of the Elder I've Council. I've been expecting you. The full council has already considered the matter of Martin's claim to the Imperial throne in detail. That's good. Saves us time. Martin Septon, on behalf of the Elder Council, I accept your wow. claim to the Imperial Chancellor Throne. Ocano. We should arrange... Chancellor Okano, the city is under attack. Oblivion gates have opened and Daedra are inside the walls. The guard is overwhelmed. Courage, soldier. We have an emperor again. Your Highness, Why was he watching me? <laughs> Why was he looking at me Shall when he said that? To the palace? No. If we let ourselves get besieged in the palace, we're doomed. We must get to the Temple of the One immediately. As you command, sire. Guards, form up and protect the Emperor. To the Temple of the One. The Imperial City is under attack. Oblivion gates have opened all over the city, and the Aedra are pouring out. I must escort Martin safely to the Temple of the One, where he can light the dragon fires, close the Oblivion gates, and save the city. That is pretty much the last... <laughs> Whoops! I'm sorry about that. I just hit Martin. Oh, I can't even use that. 
I'm gonna change that to the ebony. Oh, actually, let's just use this. Did he die? Where is he? Where's the adoring fan? Oh, he's over there. God damn it. That's a very nice armor. Come here. I want to see it. Holy hell, that's... Wow, that was really cool. I would love to have an armor that's like glowing blue or something. Let's go. The, uh, you can actually... Travel. No, no, I mean, not travel, but run as fast as you can to the Temple ah. of the One. And Martin should, should teleport there with you once you go in. So that's what I'm trying to do now. Just, uh, just run there as fast as I can. And hopefully Martin will teleport there with me. If he doesn't, I'm just gonna reload a save. As you can see, there's Oblivion Gates everywhere. This is... Mayrune's Dagon is here. The barriers between Oblivion and Tamriel have been destroyed. Her only hope now is to somehow defeat Mayrune, Mayrune's Dagon and cast him back into Oblivion. Perhaps Martin will know what to do. That's him. And I'm pretty much dead if I stay here. I'm currently silenced. That is bad. Um, potions. It's good. It's good that I have a lot of potions. That's very, very good. We're too late. Mayrun's Dagon is here. Yeah, I know. Lighting the dragon fires will no longer save us. The barriers that protected us from oblivion are gone. Can we cast him back into oblivion? I don't see how. Mortal weapons may hurt him, but now that he is physically here in Tamriel, they have no power to actually destroy him. What about the Amulet of Kings? Wait, yes. The amulet was given to mortals by Akatosh. It can